Hello everybody, this is Renee Rutten here and I decided today to do a video on um, how to get your presentations um, downloaded to your computer and into your video making software. Some people were asking questions about that and so I just thought I'd show that to you here today. So we'll start um, in our Canva um, homepage and we'll just pick on presentation and then I'm not going to change this at all. I'm just going to grab one um, that's here. So let's just grab this one. And I'm just going to throw in a few pages. Add a new page. We'll grab that one. Add a new page. And we'll just put in five or six pages here so that you can see how this works. Okay, so we've got, I don't know, five or six pages. Let's fill that one in there. Okay, so when you go to make your download, <clears throat> up here's your download arrow. Um, it is automatically going to pick the PDF um, standard for your presentations. So if you're wanting to bring it into Camtasia or iMovie or any other um, video making program, you need to change that to a PNG. That's what I use. You could probably use JPEG too, but I like to use the PNG. Okay, so then you say um, a download. Now I'm downloading all seven pages at once. You can go a page at a time if you only want a few, but I'm going to download all seven at once. So I say download. Okay, so it's going through its process of preparing and downloading. So then normally when you are just uploading to Canva, let's let it finish here. And just about wrapping up. Okay. Okay, so normally when you're just doing one image um, and you're going and um, telling it to um, upload to um you know, Facebook or whatever, you're just looking at one single image. But um, today, when you're doing um, the presentations, you're looking for a zip file. And so let's go to our downloads, and here's the zip file. Okay, now you can't take that directly into your movie maker. What you need to do is double click it and unzip it. So then here are your designs. So then you can double click and there's all your pages. And then you can just select all of those and upload them directly into your movie maker, whatever movie maker you're making or using. So hopefully that answers everyone's questions. Hopefully that's a little bit helpful. Um, so again, the PNG is what I use. The PDF will not work in a movie maker program. So use the PNG, um, download them all at once into a zip file, double click, and it will transform it to single pages. And then you can just click on that file, um, select them all and upload it to your movie maker. So I hope that's helpful and I hope you all are having a great weekend and we'll see you in the next video. Thank you, bye.